What is cellular connectivity? Cellular connectivity refers to the technology that allows mobile devices like phones and tablets to communicate wirelessly over long distances. This is achieved through a network of cell towers that transmit radio waves, enabling mobile devices to send and receive data. These towers are strategically placed to provide extensive coverage and the system is designed to hand off connections between towers as you move, ensuring continuous service for phone calls, internet access and other mobile services. Cellular networks operate on various frequencies and channels which are carefully managed to prevent interference and allow multiple users to connect simultaneously. Over time cellular technology has evolved significantly with each generation offering improvements in speed, capacity and functionality. And now let's discuss cellular network types and speeds. 1G networks. 1G first generation and earlier analog systems, the first cell Cellular standard was Advanced Mobile Phone Systems (AMPs) developed in 1980s. 1G networks were entirely analog and primarily supported voice calls with limited capacity for handling simultaneous users. These analog systems offered speeds of 14.4 kilobits per second. While revolutionary at the time, 1G networks had poor voice quality, security issues, and minimal data handling capabilities. 2G or second generation networks. Launched in the early 1990s, 2G was the first digital cellular technology. It significantly improved call quality, security and enabled SMS or text messaging, which was groundbreaking at the time. 2G introduced several standards like GSM, Global System for Mobile Communications and CDMA, Code Division Multiple Access and TDMA time division multiple access and 2G offered data speeds up to 64 kilobits per second enough for basic calls texting and very limited for mobile data with 2G encryption became possible improving security over 1G 2.5G and 2.75G GPRS and Edge as demand for mobile data grew enhanced version of 2G were developed GPRS general packet radio service and Edge or EDGE, which stands for Enhanced Data Rates of GSM Evolution, were introduced, providing moderate improvements in data transmission. 2.5G GPRS were released in late 1990s with data speeds of up to 114 kilobits per second, enabling basic internet access and MMS multimedia messaging. And 2.75G or Edge was released in early 2000s and it brought speeds up to 3. 384 kilobits per second, making web browsing and downloading possible, though still quite slow by modern standards. 3G or third generation networks introduced in the early 2000s, 3G networks provided a significant improvement in data speeds and capabilities supporting mobile internet, email and early video streaming. Key standards included UMTS, Universal Mobile Telecommunications System, which was based on WCDMA or Wideband Code Division Multiple Access and later HSPA, High Speed Packet Access. The initial the initial speed of 3G networks was 384 kilobits per second with later advancements like HSPA Plus offering up to 42 megabits per second. This enabled mobile web browsing, video calls and streaming. Fourth generation network or 4G was launched in late 2000s and 4G brought mobile internet speeds comparable to broadband enabling high definition video streaming, online gaming and more advanced mobile applications. The most common 4G standard is LTE, long term evolution, and the speeds for 4G ranged from 100 megabits per second to 1 gigabit per second depending on the network. This marked a huge leap in performance allowing for smooth streaming, fast downloads and higher network capacity for more users. And the latest generation 5G began rolling out in the late 2010s and offers unparalleled speeds, reduced latency and massive capacity to support growing number of connected devices. 5G is designed not only for smartphones but also to support emerging technologies like autonomous vehicles, smart devices, 
and Internet of Things. And 5G speeds can reach up to 10 gigabits per second with extremely low latency, less than 1 millisecond. This enables ultra fast downloads, seamless video conferencing, augmented reality, virtual reality, and widespread connectivity for smart devices and critical infrastructure. Music